Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Jennifer, also known as Jay Gibson Estes, and I'm a mixed media artist. And this is the official relaunch of my YouTube channel. I actually created this at the end of 2015, and back then the easiest thing for me to produce was videos of digital art. And while digital art is something that I do, it's not my primary focus. And I put off doing vlogs and filming me working on mixed media pieces on wood, live painting, things like that, because I didn't feel like I had the right equipment to do it. And I have a funny story about that, but I wanted to tell you two things today. So we'll go ahead and take care of the, the really big one, the one I'm super excited about. I have some changes going on in my Etsy shop. Now, as an artist, I, of course, like most artists, sell art prints of my work. And you can find my pieces on Society6, Redbubble, now Redbubble, and, of course, my Etsy shop, which is my baby. That is where my art prints are produced by me, proofed by me, signed by me, shipped by me. So that's where you get a lot of attention, is it from my Etsy shop. But I have since decided I wanted to do something a little extra because, well, I've been known to be extra. And I'm going to start hand embellishing my art prints. So that's kind of cool, right? Uh, I will be adding glitter, shine, iridescent paint, um, small elements that might not be in the original piece, and brightening the whites, darkening the blacks, that way, everyone who gets an art print from my Etsy shop is getting an original piece or as close to the original as you can get. I have done something to it. So that sets it apart from anything you can get on Redbubble or Society6. And so that's that's pretty cool. I just recently had an order on Etsy for the Moon Rabbit. So that is the first hand embellished art print that has been adopted. Thank you to Ann. And uh, she already has her piece by now. Um, but I did film the hand embellishing. So we're going to go over to that while I'll tell you a little bit about the history of this channel and what I do and how long I've been doing this and what I have, what I have planned for this channel, the things that I want to see and get from being on YouTube. So without further ado, um, as I said before, this channel was created in 2015, and I liked it. I liked doing it, um, but I've learned a lot since then, and I have gone back, and I did keep some of the best work, so if you want to go back and watch some of my digital work, uh, there'll be more pieces later, because again, I, I do work on digital pieces. Um, it might be a minute, though, because funny story. While I was getting ready to relaunch this channel, I, of course, wanted better equipment. So I got a better camera. I got me some LED lights. I got a nice little mic over here. And I went to do the High Sierra update on my Mac, and it, it flatlined my Mac. So any Mac users out there, if you've had a problem with Sierra, also High Sierra, um, I've heard a lot about crashes, um, glitches, just, I, I haven't heard of anyone's computer just flatlining and not being able to find the operating system. So if that's happened to you, I'd love to hear about it if you were able to fix it. Um, I've gone to the Geek Squad and they said that they there's nothing they could do for me. Um, I'm a smart cookie though and I have all my work backed up. Nothing gets saved on my computer. But um, if you are a Mac user, you know, purchasing a whole nother Mac is kind of painful. So um, my next step would be to contact Apple, which of course is a few weeks past the Apple Care that I'd paid for because that's the way things work, right? You, you pay for a warranty and then it dies right after the warranty is over because of life. <laughs> so here I was ready to go, dead computer, and I promptly had myself a hissy fit. 
I was a grown ass woman having a tantrum, and rightfully so because um, I have a I have a background in design. So in addition to using my computer to run my business and design and produce artwork and edit photos and now video, that kind of left me in a in a, in a sad spot. But luckily, I have a great support system. Um, I'm using my husband's laptop. I borrowed my son's webcam. <laughs> And I just jumped in and did it anyway. Because a lot of times we hit bumps and we get discouraged and you're not alone if it's happened to you. And sometimes things that we're wanting to try are scary and it's real easy to just make an excuse. Well, you know, later I'll have a better mic. Later the lighting will be better. Later, I'll have the cool art supplies that everybody else is using, the high-end stuff. I'll have any number of things. So we wait. And time goes quickly. I mean, 2015 to now, that's almost three years that I, had, well, I haven't posted in a couple of years. And it was all because I was waiting until something this that and the other it, excuses so i didn't wait any longer i hopped in with what i had to work with and what i want from this channel is to share moments like this this is real this was something that wasn't planned but we'll plow through it anyway because that's part of being a full-time artist or a working artist Finding something beautiful out of nothing. I mean, that's what the hell we do. We, <laughs> we take our imaginations. We take recycled objects. We take blank canvases, plain pieces of wood. We make pigment be a landscape. We make a marker tell a whole story. I mean, it's what we do. So the fact that something's scary or it might be a little bit hard should never stop you, ever. So <laughs> here I am, the first of many, many videos that I plan to share with you. And, um, and of course, I will be showing you more hand embellished prints as they come along because being a mixed media artist, I'm always trying new things and it's, Hopefully some things work. Sometimes they might not. So I'll tell you that too. If I put A with B and C didn't happen and I ended up with who knows what, trash. <laughs> I'll show you the trash. That way, hopefully I can keep you from doing it or maybe I can learn from you. Maybe you said, oh, but, but, but if you put A, B, and C together, it works. Maybe I just missed something. Maybe I didn't prime my service the way. So... We can learn from each other and and do this crazy art thing together. And there's a there's lots of great YouTubers out there. And as I come across more and more of these really awesome artists that work really hard and have great information to share, I'll be sharing that with you too. I'll tell you where to find them. So we're gonna I'm gonna jump in this community and I want to be a part of it and I want you to be a part of it too. So if you're here to share your art dreams, awesome. If you're here because you're a fan of mine, even better, thank you so much. Um, so if you like the Moon Rabbit and you want one of your own, the hand embellished art prints are in my Etsy shop now. Um, they will be produced by me, hand embellished by me, signed by me, given my love and shipped to you. And inside, not only will you of course get a thank you note from me because I appreciate all of you, for keeping me alive uh, and shoes on my son's feet because Jordans are expensive. Uh, you'll also get a little bit of the story because I fancy myself not only a mixed media artist, I'm a storyteller. Uh, I love fantasy and fairy tales and folklore and fables that sometimes have been forgotten. I dig them up out of dusty books and I share them in my art so that I can tell more people that way we can remember. Um, I want everyone to enjoy stories as much as I do. And sometimes telling it visually is the way to go. 
about it. I've been doing this for decades. I know a lot of stuff. And I've failed a lot. And I've succeeded a lot. And then I failed a lot. And then sometimes things that were working just stopped working. Who the hell knows why? But that's what we're here to do, right? Learn, share. So until next time, uh, stay happy, be creative, find something wonderful every day that makes you smile and share it with somebody. Just even if it's just a, a hug or a high five or a nod. Um, be good to each other, and I will see you next week.